I've never really been the one who's worried Always been the one who's keeping it cool The kind of guy who chill while others hurry I didn't know that I've been the fool I've been telling lies about something Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and if you are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Jenna. Before we get started into today's video, please make sure to like and subscribe to become part of my YouTube family. All right, first off, I want to say happy Friday, and second, I'm so excited that it is Friday, and third, what are you guys doing this weekend? Like, what are your plans? What is the weather like where you are? I'm so curious, so please let me know in the comments down below. We do not have anything planned at all. Uh, just like last weekend, we didn't have anything planned, but actually last weekend we worked on a huge project upstairs, and I am so excited to be able to share it with you guys. It's going to be a little while before I can share it, but it is a big transformation, so I'm pretty excited. But this weekend, we don't have anything really going on. I do really need to clean the house. I swear, that's all I do is clean the house, as you see in the videos, but it just, it just turns into such a mess with our family, and plus the snow is melting, and if you have dogs, you know what that means. I have probably mop my floors every day the last couple of days. I have vacuumed even more now than ever because of all the mud and the dirt being tracked in. It is a hot mess over here and the dogs need a bath so maybe that'll happen this weekend but please let me know in the comments down below what your weekend plans are. I won't make it easy for you now. On this day, it was time to wash both Savannah's sheets and our sheets, and at this point when I'm cleaning, Maverick is in his room taking a nap, so I could not wash his sheets, but I did do it the next day. I try to wash all of our sheets on the same day, just get it done, get it over with, and I now officially have two sets of sheets, you guys, thanks to my mother-in-law, and they are so nice and soft and comfortable. I love them, so now I have two sets of sheets thanks to her. I'm so appreciative, and I have to say that because in my last uh, cleaning video, I told you guys I only had one set, but now I have two. I am one of those people now. You got two minutes of my time, and I don't really break too easily, but I'm worth it, cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight, oh. Watch me break in your sweat You're falling into me, touch me I swear You would do anything that I want So keep us awake till the dawn Ooh, Baby, real free I wanna make you sweat on me I wanna make you And here I am warming up my coffee For probably the second or third time that morning I swear I warm up my coffee so many times if you're a mom or just anybody, let me know how many times you warm up your coffee every day. So at this point, I am doing my flow nays, like little nasal stuff that I have to do. If you are new here, you might not know that I have had issues with my allergies, breaking out in hives. So the nasal mist is one of the new things that I have to do every single day in each nostril. And I really, and like I now that I know how to use it, um... I don't mind it so much and I'm also trying out this new method cleaner that day and my husband came home and he said that everything that the house smelled so good and I was like well it's my new method cleaner and he is obsessed with method so am I he says that they smell good and I don't have a sense of smell but I just really like the way they clean they do a really good job and they last a really long time too which I think some cleaners you can just go through so fast in my opinion I think I go through Mrs. Meyer so fast compared to method like a method all-purpose cleaner will last me forever where a Mrs. Myers I will just go through it so fast you wrapped around my finger but don't you try to call me tomorrow there's nothing personal in having a little fun you wait to see if it's worth your while. Oh, oh, oh. so give me so give me your all I'll take it I'll take it tomorrow oh, I'll stick like glue inside your mind just watch me break in your sweet You're falling into me, touch me I swear You would do anything that I want So keep us awake till the dawn Ooh, baby, feel free I wanna make you sweat on me
are new here, my name is Jenna and I am a wife and a mom to two littles. I have a three-year-old daughter and an almost a nine-month-old son. As you see, I have three dogs and it is crazy around here. And I post every single Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And on my channel, you are going to find tons of cleaning and laundry motivation, DIY projects, grocery hauls, anything really motherhood, lifestyle, the occasional vlogs. That is what you are going to see on my channel. And if that sounds like something you are interested, please make sure to like and subscribe to become part of my YouTube family. It really helps a small channel like mine grow. And I appreciate and love my subscribers so much. So if you are new, go ahead and leave a comment down below so I can get to know you better. So I'm sure you guys see in most of my cleaning videos that I always have my iPad nearby and the reason why is because I'm always watching something on my iPad especially while Maverick naps. Right now I'm watching my friend Tony from Chaotic Country. I'll go ahead and link her down below but that was who I was watching at the time. I am always watching something. I'm either watching Netflix shows, Hulu, or I am catching up on all of my YouTube friends and at this moment I was catching up on my friend Tony and these books that I'm showing you, the one I'm flipping through, we actually got for free from the Dolly Parton program, the book program, the monthly subscription that is free. And I love getting new books. The kids love getting new books. I read a book to them every single day. And Maverick is really getting into books. And it is just the cutest thing ever. <music>
guys ever feel like you are literally cleaning the same spots in your house every single day because that is my life especially being a stay-at-home mom I'm literally cleaning the exact same spots and areas of my house like this high chair and the countertops and the dining room and the floor you know what let's be real I'm cleaning the whole downstairs every single day pretty much and it is exhausting and I get the occasional comment here or there where someone says how do you get your house so dirty this and that and let me tell you what Having two little ones, my husband and I, and three dogs, things get messy fast. And I am all about showing you guys a realistic mess because this is my life. Like, I, I mean, this is every single day I am doing this. And this is a lived-in home. And I let my kids, I mean, it's a clean mess, okay? That is what I heard from my grandma my great-grandma. When there are toys on the floor... It's not a dirty mess. It is a clean mess because, you know, it's just toys here or there. And I am trying to clean, like, the dirty, dirty part. I'm just trying to clean up with the house because living with three dogs is a lot, especially with the snow melting. I think I mentioned that earlier. The snow melting is real, and especially with Maverick crawling on the floor, it just seriously grosses me out with him and is putting his hands in his mouth. So that is why it might seem like I'm constantly cleaning and I'm putting up my curtains because I actually, over the weekend, washed all of my curtains, all of them, because when we moved in, we got these curtains for free with the house, and we only washed a couple of them. We didn't wash all of them, and with the issues I'm having with my allergies, I decided to just go ahead and wash all of them because there's probably dust and dust mites on them, and that is what I am highly allergic to. Would you stay till the morning light? Or would you follow me? Or would you let it be? If I leave tonight, we could do this right. We'll find the remedy. Or would you stay with me now till the morning light? Before you turn away, I just want you to know that I didn't throw your stuff away. Before you make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find I'm standing right here I know that I told you we're over I swear that I'm sober Just listen, I miss you And I know that I said all these things But now when you're with her I can see that That you miss if you guys didn't see my last big cleaning video, then you don't know that my son Maverick loves the vacuum cleaner. He will follow me around the entire time while I'm vacuuming and he thinks it's a little game. He will laugh. As soon as I pull it out, he laughs. He loves the vacuum cleaner and just chases me around the house and it makes vacuuming even more of a workout than it is, especially on this rug, but it is just the cutest thing ever just re-watching this and filming, but this is my life. This is what it's like for me to clean with my two little kids. Also, as you see on the couch, my daughter is having a little bit of tablet time because her lunch is cooking and she's just kind of winding down. After lunchtime, she pretty much just chills because that's when Maverick takes his nap and that's kind of like our quiet time since she doesn't take naps anymore and it's been working pretty well. There are some days where she needs a nap really bad when she wakes up super early, but she's been doing really good. She turned three in January and I am so excited to say to you guys that Savannah is going to be starting gymnastics and I'm so excited for her. I think she's really going to love it.
Like I had mentioned earlier, my house doesn't stay clean for long, especially with the toys, but at this point my son Maverick is upstairs taking a nap and I am clearing the floor because I am going to start folding some laundry. I am trying to stay on top of it, but yet again I am just a little bit behind. I feel like that always happens, but you know what, whatever. It is what it is. It's okay. It's just laundry. You can get your clothes out of a clothes basket. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. And while I am folding this laundry, you will see all three of my dogs hanging out and cuddling with me. They figure, well, there's no kids around, so we can all go and cuddle with mom. That is exactly what they are thinking. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control. You push me, then you pull me back in. Don't know if I can decipher how your mind works. Yeah, you leave me wondering what it's like to feel your skin. I will keep on trying till You give me a sign Give me a sign Ah, oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more You leave me hanging, begging for more Think that I'm addicted to this Can't resist to be a little risky and go for it cause I want you close I'm so exposed when you're keeping me wondering You know I'd do anything to be in your arms again So give me a sign Give me a sign Oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more Talking to you talking to Here we go again Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in while I was doing the laundry, I said that my daughter Savannah was having her quiet time while her brother was napping. Well, I was wrong. Um, she trashed her toy room even more, and she did it being quiet. I had no idea she was doing any of this. So, yeah, that's just lovely. And I wanted it all clean because I wanted to play in the playroom with Maverick, and I didn't want all the toys all over the floor, especially the little ones. So, I decided to clean up the playroom while she actually had her real quiet time out in the living room. And I made sure she wasn't trashing that while I was cleaning this playroom. So, give me a sign. Uh, uh, uh. could go for this, no more tricks We could take things slow Say you think about it too When the lights go out and there's no doubt That I should be with That I should be We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going No control, you push me then you pull me back in mm -mm -mm. We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going, no control You push me, then you pull me back in So give me a sign Give me a sign Baby, just give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more Talking to you and here we go again Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in So give me a sign
Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground And I, I really wanna know, really wanna know If I, let figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down dread doing I am just not a fan of making the bed please let me know if you're the same way it's just uh, I just can't stand doing it I just really can't but here I am with my new sheets so excited they look really nice and if you're wondering what I'm looking at when I keep looking up I am addicted to my show I know I've mentioned it in one of my videos but I am so addicted let me know if you have watched it or if you are thinking about watching it because I'm obsessed with the show. My mom got me hooked. I am obsessed with Rain on Netflix. And I love talking about it. I'm obsessed with the history of it. And I just, I love it. I'm sorry. I'm going to quit talking about it. But I love the show Rain. It is so good. If you have watched it or heard about it or if you want to watch it, let me know because I love talking about the show. It's really good. No limit to what we can do. We know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things 
things are finally right With you and I the future is bright oh, You and I we got it oh, We don't need no more oh, Even in the hard times Also, before I end this video, I want to apologize for the lighting while I'm making my bed. It is obviously nighttime, and that is why the lighting is so terrible. Yes, you see my ring light over there, but you know what? It was the end of the day. I just really wanted to film this, and then I wanted to go take a shower and go to bed because I was exhausted from all of the cleaning and all of the laundry that I did, plus playing with the kids, hanging out with my husband. There was just a lot going on, so I apologize for the lighting, but you know what? That's life. Realistic is what it is. But I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was really long, so if you made it to the end, you are such a trooper. But I hope it motivated you to clean or do something before the weekend starts so your house is good and ready to go because I know mine won't last very long over the weekend with all of us being home. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to like and subscribe to become part of my YouTube family. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye. I've never really been the one who's worried Always been the one who's keeping it cool The kind of guy who chill while others hurt